What's going on guys, the Inhuman Pete, and I'm back with more Marvel Avengers Alliance. So, last time we started up Mission 3, using Baron Mordo, Baron Mordo to uh, defeat Umar, and having Thunder and Juggernaut play with uh, Hela. And so now, apparently, here's Malekith, leading a crew of Hela's undead to meet Morgan the Fae. Do we take them out now, or we wait until all th our three witches and the minions are in one place? Uh, we will be taking them down. Uh, let's see. A group of vigilante citizens just set this building on fire because they think there are vampires inside. Send someone to get people out and handle the vampires if the vigilantes were right. Uh, seems like a daredevil kind of job. We've seen him in battle already. Alright, so, Malekith is on the scene and we get to go fight him. Yes, thank you for liking my stuff. Alright, Malekith. Malekith, what's other world to you? New horizons, new worlds to conquer, new thralls, new spoils, and the weakening of Asgard. About what I expected? Right then. <laughs> just, just no other words, just like, okay, let's throw down. Depending on how long this episode goes on, depends on whether or not I'll include the epic boss in this, uh, in this video or not. Despite the fact we've technically already seen him, but, you know, just for the sake of stuff, I guess. I don't really know. Alright. First things first, V for victory, despite the fact I don't really need it, but it does add agile to the team. Then, Trench Warfare. Next on the list, Magnetic Maneuver. Web this guy. An extra turn, but he's webbed up so we can't do anything. And... <laughs> Repelled, uppercut. No more Malekith. And I'll take care of this Dark Elf. he couldn't do anything. Which leaves him to the vices of Union Jack to kill. Alright. I'm actually uh, surprised. I wasn't expecting uh, Spider-Girl or Amazing Spider-Girl to actually do that much damage to it, but still well received. Alright. That takes care of Malekith. There's Dark Evs all over this, all over the place. I think I got him. Uh, who? Malekith? I doubt it. I'm not sure he can be destroyed. He can be, but Jack has not done it. That is not a criticism. Riding this world of Malik ridding this world of Malekith even temporary has made our path much easier. Now it's time to go after Morgan Le Fay. Agreed. And there she is. All assets we have lo we have locked in on the ritual. Morgan Le Fay is beginning the final enchantment. If we don't stop her now, she's going to open a gateway. Straight from the dark dimension to Otherworld. With a whole lot of vampires and mindless ones ready to come through. This is where we get heroic, people. We don't want Otherworld to become a vampire smorgasbord. I see her. Anyone who, anyone who wants to come along is more than welcome. Alright. Before that, let's go pick up all of our heroes who are doing everything they were doing. Neurotoxins, that sells... Uh, Colossus. And Doctor Strange. They are eliminated, and the portal is shut. Clearly this was a distraction. Umar is keeping our attention divided while Morgan the Fae prepares her final enchantment. Alright. Go! Cool. I got a, uh... Vile thing. Yay. Yay. <laughs> All right, Morgan Le Fay is the final adversary. Let's go, uh, let's go play with her. I might actually use Mordo for this one just to make it, you know, ironic using both Spec Ops characters. Otherworld's defenses are already being reinforced. Strange, Drum, and Mordo are counting your enchantment as we speak. 
You've lost Morgan. Strange drama, Mordo. Sounds like an occult law firm. Hella failed to draw out your powers, I see. Just as you're going to fail at subjugating Otherworld. Even if I didn't care about it, the last thing we need is Otherworld-powered vampires stalking London. No, girl. The last thing you need is to be on my bad side. However, you seem determined to remain there. Once Otherworld is my power, in my power, you will find yourself subjugated to far worse than Hela's expirations. Comforting. Alright. Mordo, I require your aid once more. And because this is also a decent way to level you up. <laughs> but don't tell nobody! Alright, so... These guys are really... Uh, none of these guys have classes yet, so I'm just gonna go ahead and... Fiery fist each one of them. Insert fisting joke here. Right. Astral phase. Because why the hell wouldn't I? Alright, now it's up to the Dark Elf. What will you do? Ah, going after Spitfire. Seriously, what's with going after Spitfire? How did he get- oh, right. From Baron Mordo. I was about to say, how did he get straining? Uh, I'll go after the stronger of the two. There we go. Oh good, you actually turned into an infiltrator. That's gonna make this a ton more easy. Or easier. See if I can't kill this one. Cool, dead. Awesome. Use party time to give my team some uh, stamina because they're kind of lacking on it, I suppose. A word. Use the psychic amplifier and then I'll kill this thing. <laughs> Not really a hollowed type character, but I'll still stake it in the fucking heart because. That's fun. Alright, vampires, goody. First things first. Attack run. And we will win. And since all of her attacks are stealthy, I'm able to get in and completely destroy this guy. Bolts of Balthok. And I guess Mordo will help kill the final one and then I like that since astral uh, what is it astral phase I don't know astral form was gonna end up in next turn and now it's time for the battle with Morgan Le Fay hopefully I don't end it too quickly so first things first attack run Get some bleeding on her. That applies fatal blow, nothing really else. Okay. And fiery fist. Wonder, do I still have CQC? Yes, I do. Bolts of Balthok. Brawl. Beast of Crows. Well, that was actually kind of anticlimactic. I didn't even get to use uh, Spitfire's, you know, special punchy attack to finish him. Or finish her. Okay. <laughs> but we did fuck her up. And Mordo, you get to go train after we go kill uh, Dormammu. Alright, so weapon for this is... Cursed Potion Launcher. All enemies get Bane. It's pretty good for a magic team. Blood magic. Bleeding increases damage dealt. Takes reduced damage from bleeding. You know what that'd be perfect for? Fucking Nico. Buff supply blessing. Alright. That looks like I'm gonna get the, uh... 
Curse potion launcher. Launcher. Eh, I guess that's okay. All right. Did we do it? I don't know. What's the word from Otherworld? Morgan Le Fay isn't here, we know that much. Neither are any of the others. There are no paths open from uh, Otherworld to anywhere but here. Ah, yes. Otherworld survives. Its astral protections are intact. Project projections? Yeah. That's good news for sure. Now all we have to do is make sure we've st we've gotten rid of Dracula. Even if he's not eating fairies, he's still eating Londoners. Alright, restart everything. Alright. Let's uh, get back Daredevil. And let's go fight ourselves a Dormammu. I should have enough highest away to go kill him. Oh cool, I four started. Now I have 10 additional ISOs if need be. Alright, let's find out uh, how this all sums up nicely. Well, I guess you can't kill Dracula. Yes, you can. Then I wish you'd hurry up and do it. What I was saying is that even if we can't kill him, we at least made London a little too hot for him and his vampires. And the mindless ones. London survives. Otherworld survives. <laughs> London prevails. I wish I could remember that quote from V for Vendetta. Uh, what was it? Uh, I don't remember. We all survived too. Plus, we have a new pal in Baron Mordo. Welcome to Shield, BM. Oh, never mind. I'll find a new nickname. <laughs> He's not the only one. Spitfire finally seen the light, so to speak. She'll be working with us too. MI13 cleared it. They did, but I would have done it either way. Bureaucrats only exist to say yes to what I already wanted. I like her. <laughs> oh my god, he actually said it. I like her. <laughs> Back to New York. We've got new people to brief, and there's the little matter of the worthy to attend to. Good work, people. Yay. But as said, our journey is not done, so I'll be back in just a moment to go tackle Dormammu. Okay, and I'm back. So it took me some time, but I was managed to do it. And I decided, since this is kind of a short episode anyways, I'm going to three-bird the uh, boss Hela as well with Malekith and Dracula because I didn't do that last time because I've been trying to do, like, the mini-bosses and stuff uh, for that. Yeah. I will definitely have enough Isoites to finish off Spec Ops here and, here, here and now. All right, so... You know what, um, I think since we already have a character who gets like double turns and is kind of fast, uh, let's have a second one. Let's have, uh, let's have Quicksilver and Spitfire, because I don't think I ever tried that combo before, and I don't know why, but yeah, mainly because they're also just going to completely annihilate uh, Malekith in the first round because he's an infiltrator. <laughs> Um, I also refreshed the page, so now everything should be moving smoothly because there's not, like, uh, a thousand fucking things on the screen. <laughs> Build up the fiery fists. Attack run. <laughs> Quicksilver's turn with blinding punches and tag team. And second verse, same as the first. And that wasn't uh, that, that wasn't too terrible for like uh, two two attempts at attacks. Not bad. So he turned into a bruiser. That's great. Um, uh, my cannon. And I got my hollow flamethrower back out because I was just blowing through fights because quicker that way. Bleed won't kill him. I'm probably after this last attack. It'll kill him. And Quicksilver will use tag team. I should probably farm for Quicksilver's EI so from his heroic mission. Slow rated healing. What? Oh, gradually restores health during combat. Okay. Unable to use melee attacks until hit by any action. Oh, that's all he's got is melee though. Right, let's fix that up with a 
Last page of the Vashanti. And I'm gonna keep trying to hit Malekith. Actually, this should finish Malekith. Not so much the Dark Elf, but I'm really not that concerned with the Dark Elf. Dark Elf is like the lowest thing on my priorities right now. At least out of this thing. Alright, so now I'll just go ahead and use the Solid Slug Shotgun to kill him. Next wave. Dracula and some vampires, no problem. Uh, you know what? Nah, I'll just go ahead and punch him. I was debating on whether I should, like, bite into him, but... It doesn't really help her combo at all, so... It's not really worth using. Alright. How much does that set me at? I only have two quickness? Alright, well, might as well kill this guy to get more quickness. Oh no, she got bit by another vampire. She now mutates and does something else now. <laughs> that always seems to be how she got her powers. It's like, oh, I got bit by a vampire and I got a transfusion from this. Oh, look, I got more powers. More transfusion, more powers! I'm not saying it's a bad thing. I'm just saying, like, it'd be funny. Like, if she's bitten by a vampire or, like, healed, she has a chance of mutating more. I don't know. That just seems like a... I don't know. I I'm rambling now. It's early in the morning and... <laughs> oh god. Yeah. We will win! So she declares. I think that basically has it where we join in on her attack. Right, tag team? Yes it is. Cool. That would have been a lot more poetic if we had actually killed her. Or if we had killed him. Daredevil took or not Daredevil, fuck, I don't I can't characters right now. Dracula takes off because we killed him. Alright. Fast is Furious uh, five times. So I'll probably use attack run twice. Uh or nope, never mind. I can't. I forgot. Alright. <laughs> never mind, I won't be doing that. Uh, plus I will get some extra damage on her with the help of Quicksilver and myself. Alright, Quicksilver. Let's see, you get Quickness too. United. This isn't stealthy, unfortunately. So I'd basically be forced to attack this guy. I saw I'd just go ahead and use Tag Team. Yeah, even then it's still not enough, so... I guess I'll just go after the big guy, try hurting him. Oh, that's right, I forgot the join in on attack thing. <laughs> I forgot we had that, despite the fact I looked at it. And I just immediately crossed it off my mind for some reason. Give Spitfire stamina, because she's really been blowing through it. And there we go. And I actually forgot, I have a hollow flamethrower to get rid of these assholes. There we go, now it's Hella's turn. Oh, right, she summons more. Oh, fuck. <laughs> That's what I get for forgetting shit. Alright. But I'm gonna have her go ahead and just blow through hell of a sleeping tiger. Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and punch him. Because I just realized these guys are generalists now and they're not class specific, so he's no longer a bruiser, so I should be able to just completely decimate them. They're not nearly as strong as, say, uh, the actual versions. Love how he dodged every single fucking attack, but it won't matter, he's getting a stake to the heart. Or not! Or he will do nothing. Oh, he's got Skittering Darkness, that's why. Okay. Uh, 
Huh? Fuck, I guess I got no choice. I'm just gonna punch him. Oh, I'm nom nom! I hate this guy so much right now. Is that just a chance to, uh, okay, 50% chance to dodge attacks, period. All right. Well, hope for the best. Cool. Right, if I got too fast as furious. Um, yeah, I might as well see if I hit him. And I do, actually. Cool. All right, no more Draugr. And that'll leave, lead us to fight uh, Dormammu now. I love how that whole boss rush... None of the bosses gave me problems. No, it's the Draugr that fucking gives me problems. Also, I leveled up, apparently. <clears throat> so, cool. All right. I forget what they get, but it looks like I'm getting a vial anyways, so it doesn't matter. This hollowed rounds. Begins combat with... Sacred? I don't know what that does. But I'm getting a vial. I am the magic man. Which is good, because I do want to kind of build this set. If nothing else, for just shits and giggles. Because it's like, I completed this in under a week. The fuck else am I supposed to do? And I have Mordo. I have really no reason to come back now. Alright. Let's go take care of Baron Mordo now. Not Baron Mordo, Dormammu. I'm getting my names confused. Alright, so... We had him team up with Strange last time, so let's have, uh... Dr. Voodoo come in. That's probably racist. Like the voice I used for him, but I honestly don't care. <laughs> Grace note, all the mindless ones get to go first, apparently. Dormammu will class change, hopefully not to a tactician. Otherwise, we will be screwed. Uh -huh. Where is your sister? But luckily with, uh... Dr. Voodoo here, we're actually immune to most magical attacks. So, that's a positive, I suppose. Alright, that was new. Wasn't expecting that. The fuck was that? Sense of Dread, pre-counters most attacks by attackers- Oh, damage over time. Okay, yeah. Well, vote on crows. And fuck you, I am astraling. Oh, whoops, wrong. Hmm? I can't die attack. Meh. Uh, <laughs> Chance need a shield before we take down the chance. Okay. So I still don't know why I can't use Astral Projection. So I'm just gonna recharge then. Because I don't want to use Bolts of Balthuck yet. Someone let me know in the comments down below why I can't do that. Is it just a glitch or is there something I'm missing in his, like, description of it? I'd love to know, seriously. Bugging the shit out of me. Do I have to take an attack for it to work? How does it work? Someone let me know. Someone smarter than me, tell me. Thank you. You know, I'm just gonna refresh, or not refresh, uh, recharge. There we go. Turn on the tech spell. And see, I can't, I still can't fucking use it. The, the shit.
Oh, I lost it. Okay, that's the problem. Never mind. I got it now. Alright. I must have got hit by something and I lost it. That's weird. Whatever. He's he's dead. <laughs> Alright. I didn't even realize that. Alright, so never mind. I fixed it. You're all going to comment anyways, but please don't. Delete your comments. <laughs> anyways. Uh, maybe I'll get a chance of getting the epic uh, boss weapon now. But first things first, we got Spitfire. I like how most of her attack was off screen. <laughs> All right. Ah, Agent. Delighted to make your acquaintance. I look forward to working with you in the field. Don't worry, I don't bite. Much. Uh, blood magic. I, I would also go for that one too. I don't mind that. So my benef so what I really want is I want the fetish of calamity. Mainly because I don't want to have to research it. Nope. Oh well. I'll be back. And in greater numbers too. Alright. Well, that's been Spec Ops. Uh did I four star? Yes! That's more gold! <laughs> so, I'll probably start work- I'll probably start building on the witches- Uh, the witch set, or whatever the hell it's called. I don't know what the hell this set is called. I'm gonna probably four star so I can build the craft. That's the only one I really can't farm or get lucky to get. But, yeah! Um, that's it. So, until next time guys, I will catch you all later. Asta.